What's in my teacher rucksack? Welcome to videos that you've absolutely not asked for, but I'm gonna share them anyway because I enjoy watching these types of videos. So maybe you will too. So this is my teacher rucksack. This is a bag by a company called Ryoko. I think this is called the Madison rucksack. It is a full leather bag. Leather comes with some great qualities. Um, as you can see, starting to age nicely and <laughs> based on my treatment, which has been not very well, you can start to see that it's got its own kind of unique design. You've got to be a little bit careful about the way that you treat it. Um, with rain, it can soak in the water quite a lot, so definitely better for the summer days. You've got to be careful with oil and stuff like that too, but this stores lots of great things, and it looks a little bit smarter going to work too. So, on the back, you've got the two straps, and straight away you'll see the first thing that I have, and it's a carrier bag, but clipped into what's called a hero clip. The hero clip is something that I really enjoy using when I'm traveling out and about. What I'll often do as well is this is my mug. If I fill this up, I'll also slot this in so that as I'm carrying this, you'll be able to, uh, as I'm carrying this, this just then slots through and then I can just hook that on like that, which is great. So that's fantastic. So then going forward, around the back, you've got this laptop section. So in the laptop section, you've got, as you can imagine, my laptop, my 14-inch MacBook Pro, or I'll bring my 13-inch uh, MacBook Air, which is my work computer. Alongside that, I can also fit some documents and things like that in there too. So this is something I'm going to work on after work. This is the uh, Teach Broad Atlas. So getting your first teaching job, kind of looking further afield. This is just a draft I'm working on at the moment. So yeah, that can just slot in there like that. On the front section here, this opens up quite well. When you initially get it, it's a little bit tighter, but then you can start to break it in. At the moment, I've just literally got a pen, but there's some extra sections in there as well where you can fit extra bits and pieces, whether it's like keys and things like that. Then this section inside here is great because it can store loads. So at the moment, I've got this is a storage thing by Peak Design. Peak Design do all sorts of great things. And at the moment, I'm filming on the one thing that is usually inside here. So let me show you that now. So that's the Osmo Pocket, and the tripod can often fit in that carrier bag that I've shown you instead of my lunch too. And then inside here, I'll also have my SSD if I need it, microphone if I decide to create some different videos and bits and pieces like that, uh, and then extra tripod, smaller tripod for the... Uh, Osmo Pocket 3 if I need it too. Further down, inside here, protein bottle, because I'll go to the gym after work, so that's always great to, to have with me. Gym clothes, bits and pieces, socks, whatever I can find. At the moment, this is a Gymshark set. On the inside here, you'll also be able to see a front pocket. This front pocket is really deep. When I'm traveling, I use this all the time. So at the moment, it's got some hand sanitizer, because working with children. It's also got my Ryoko sunglasses. So those, there we go. And then I've also got my inhaler too, because it ain't easy being wheezy. Further down inside the bag, in the flappy section that we've got down here, You'll see that I've got a notebook. This is actually quite a thick notebook again, so able to store lots of different bits and pieces. This is again, if I'm writing or I need that for my organization. And then right at the very, very bottom, we start to get to a few more interesting things. So this is my gym set. This is my wrist straps, belt, and then hand straps for things like that too. Gripping onto bits and pieces and yeah, we keep going. Spray, because no one likes someone stinking in the gym. This is like a little foldable water bottle. Again, if I need it for when I'm doing cardio at the gym. So there we go. What's in my teacher rucksack? I feel like I haven't done one of these in a while, so I've decided to make one now. And hopefully you've enjoyed the video. If you have, feel free to like it. If you haven't, then, well, thank you for staying on the video anyway. Um, if you want to go and check out some of the guides, bits and pieces that I showed you within the video, feel free to check out my website, teachtroubletriumph.com. Subscribe for more, and hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Until then, I'm out.